Well, I'm out here at Eklutna Power Plant. This is a hydroelectric plant out here in the old Glen Highway. And I believe it's still producing power. You wonder where in the world does the water come from? Well, it comes right through that mountain there. So there's a tunnel that runs under that mountain and comes out of Eklutna Lake. So I'm not sure exactly where it starts into the tunnel over there, but it runs right underneath this mountain and comes right over here to Clutin the power plant. Hydroelectric power, you can see kind of where we are. There's, uh, you can see the peak up there, Pioneer Peak up there. That's kind of where we are. So the water runs in there and then comes underneath the road here. Wait till this car goes by. And then goes right behind me into the, uh, what we call the Clutin the tail race. If I can get this camera turned around we'll see it. Well, I had to mess with the camera. I couldn't figure out how to get it to face the other way, but here we are. And uh, yeah, my nice hairdo. You can see the water behind there and uh, there's a hatchery here. And so one of the few places you can catch kings real close to Palmer. Fantastic location. All right, let's look at the market memo. You can see here, 63 new listings came on the market this week and 57 pended. So we actually had a little bit of an increase in our inventory for once. You can see also that 46 places closed. So we're finally closing some of the places out. But there's still well over 500 houses that are under contract right now. Cars running by, they had to pick this time, it was quiet for a while. Over 500 houses under contract, and I, um, I'm going to give accurate information on my email this week. As several people point out that I missed some stuff last week, but I'm going to show you with those pendings what's really pending, and you can see where the market really is. There's uh, the market's really hot in the lower price ranges, as you might imagine, and not nearly as hot when you get way up in the higher price ranges. But total on the market, 208. I think that's up about two or three from last week. Um, notice the the price right there 435,000 those are the ones that are not selling okay 400 so you can see that the average sales price is lower than that but not a huge amount not a huge amount but that bumps it up a little bit and, the, and it's the higher price ones that stay on the market longer the lower price ones sell in a matter of days sometimes hours that's what's really going on all right we're going to be fishing here pretty soon uh you know what if you're really hardcore you'll be fishing in this water about exactly a month from now you might even catch a king all right talk to you later you can watch john doing his thing on his sled while you decide which one of these fantastic people to call just call one of them or text them or you can email them just by typing in their first name and at valleymarket.com and it'll get to them like jay at valleymarket.com martha at valleymarket.com and so on give somebody a call it will definitely help you out this is a crazy market and they are experienced and working with it